Thank you, Secretary of State Garbea. The next order of business is the election of the Speaker of the House. Are there any nominations? The chair will recognize Representative Mary Messier. Good afternoon, everyone. I am proud to nominate Representative K. Joseph Shikachi to the position of Speaker of the House of Representatives for the legislative term of 2021 and 2022. He is exactly the speaker that the House needs to get us through these challenging times. As the majority leader for the past four years, Joe Shikachi has proven himself to be sincere, honest, and extremely accommodating to all of us. One of his strongest traits is that he is a good listener. He doesn't impart his own views on us, but he actually wants to hear our ideas and our viewpoints. I have always found him to be extremely approachable and easy to talk to, and he treats everyone with the utmost respect. Even before officially becoming speaker, Joe has exerted great leadership. He quickly created a task force to examine the distribution of the COVID vaccine and appointed a diverse group of members, including those from Providence, Central Falls, and my home city of Pawtucket, all communities so hard hit by the pandemic. We have already met three times and he is eager to learn about the unique problems in our cities. I also admire how quickly he acted in taking charge after he received the overwhelming support of the caucus. He secured this safe and spacious Veterans Auditorium to enable us to safely social distance and smoothly conduct a very successful budget session a few weeks ago. Even though Joe had never been on the Finance Committee, he worked with Chairman Abney and gathered input from his colleagues, holding multiple briefings with Democrats and Republicans. He works closely with the Senate and developed a budget that was approved with huge support and quickly signed by the governor. With those accomplishments in just a few short weeks, I'm tremendously optimistic about the future of his leadership. As a retired educator, it heartens me that Joe values the hard work and dedication of our public school teachers, and he is deeply concerned about the future of our schools. I also know how passionate he is to tackle other important issues like increasing affordable housing opportunities, making sure our workers earn fair wages, and providing assistance to small businesses. He has a proven track record of addressing economic issues, and with his steady hand, he will lead this house to the other side of the pandemic, and we will turn the fortunes of our state around. It's not going to be an easy job. But I know that Joe Shikachi is the right speaker at the critical point in our state's history. There's an old saying attributed to Abraham Lincoln. You can please some of the people all of the time. You can please all the people some of the time, but you can't please all the people all the time. Joe Shikachi will do his best to please as many people as possible in his always respectful manner. But his eyes are wide open, and he knows that he won't always please everyone. It's a tough job being speaker, but Joe Sircacci is ready. For those reasons and many more, I enthusiastically submit the name of Representative K. Joseph Sircacci into nomination as Speaker of the House of Representatives and ask my colleagues to give him their support to lead this chamber for the next two years. Thank you. Thank you, Representative. 